aiming at work all week. We went to Roll World, didn't we? Yeah. And some show off fell over and nearly broke his uh, broke his wrist. <laughs> uh, Shouldn't really be in today either with the wrist. It's too I know, bad. I know, I know, but. Um, I had a garden wall come up. <clears throat> we can't actually start it today. Um, we can't start it till Monday, but the bricks are there. Um, so me and Amy's going in. I, Tom made plans because we obviously weren't in, so he couldn't come in today. Um, so uh, we're just gonna go in and we're gonna get a little look at the wall. Um, gonna get set up, profile set up, all lasered up. Pro, um, gauged up um, and start getting some loading out done. Um, it's got Tom's got the van with everything in it, so we're just popping to go to Tom's now. It's quite late, it's nine o'clock, um, not really in any rush today, as we're not actually laying anything, setting some profiles up. It's probably only going to take a couple of hours tops, um, it's probably about not even that about an hour and a half to set some profiles up so um, I like to set the profiles up um, obviously because then I can ping lines off the profiles and then I can get my exact because I'm quite meticulous with my loading out so I can get the exact measurement from the wall because when you um, don't have a wall there to load off of Sometimes it can you can end up loading out a little bit too far or a little bit too close But if you get the profile set up and string some lines up you can see Exactly where you want the loading out to be done. So that's what we're doing today They're just jet washing the house He's done the back and he's just jumped on the side now. So we're gonna wait <laughs> Because the stone fans are getting soaked. Do you? No. <laughs> yeah, look, that's, that's, so He's uh, once the house is done, the scaffold comes down. Um, MBL, who uh, we do some work for, they send round their jet washer man and he goes around and cleans all the face work, which actually brings it up quite nice. Um, I mean, doesn't that just get water in all the wheat poles though? Water in all the wheat poles, yeah. No, he, he won't directly go over a wheat pole. Well, I don't know, I don't he watch did, him. I just but... watched him. Well, a wheat pole up the top. Is that a wheat pole there or is that just a, a hole that hasn't been joined <laughs> I don't know, I've got my glasses on, I can't see from here. Well, Amy, have you told them? No. Tell them then. I'm back. You're back, full time, for good. The uni's done. Uni's done. Yeah. Say so yeah. well done to me, guys, it's been a stressful three years. She's done three years at uni. All good, all done now, ain't ya? Yeah. Well, I just got to submit my dissertation. Submit my dissertation. Hope I pass, and then we'll have a graduation date. Yeah, that'd be good. So yeah, Amy's back full time. Yay! Now it's good. <laughs> that is no, it is. It's good to have you back because. Uh... Been doing shit without me. Let's be honest. No videoing's been done. <laughs> no work's been done. Yeah. Well, yeah. Oh well. Uh, anyway, right. Uh, we're going to just wait for this uh, geezer to do his uh, bits and bobs on the house. And then we're going to um, get some profiles set up. Hello. profiles as well so we're going to use them today more box set of course it's a bit nippy here hey it's a bit nippy here yeah so we need eight bits of box section six yeah let's have a look see what we need over there should we just go have a look just cleaned it all up <laughs> just <laughs> does polish the turd pretty well right so here's the wall few steps in it. It's down to here. I'll squint down the end and squint on the corner. Don't have the squints for it so they want us to bird peek it which oh well <laughs> don't look great but that's what they want. 
just comes down to here and just finishes here. All right, so now we've set up the external profiles. We have to do them first. So, because basically, because it, the line's been pulled off at an angle like that, I need to know, the only way I know exactly where to put this internal profile is by measuring off of these lines to find the exact point of the corner. Um, so that's why you have to do the outside profiles first. So that way I can string my line on, which I've strung down to there. So through here. And then the same here. And then what I'll do is I'll put the line right down as far as it'll go, down to there. And then I can put my brick here and here. And this way, I know where my point is to put the profile. So it turns out that these profiles, with the batten, it gets right in the way, goes into the wall, which is no good. So we're just gonna profiles on the external, and then I'll just build small corners and run in the back while Amy's running the front. What we're gonna do now is take a level off of the house, and transfer it onto the profiles and then gauge gauge up the profiles so we know we've got a nice level playing ground to work off of. What I like to do is obviously get my um, get my course that I'm gonna level off of all the way around and then I'll actually number the courses down so I don't get lost anywhere. Um, it's very easy to get lost on um, it's very easy to get lost on what course you're on, on what line you're on when you've got um, drops in the footing. So we're gonna get the laser level set up and sort that out. So what we're doing now is finding roughly, right, so we're roughly about here. So what we're gonna do is put it on a course of the brick and then move this. Onto all the other profiles. Cut or carry on? Carry on. Set everyone's dogs off. Yeah. Can I stop a minute? My phone's ringing. Yeah, you're on. So now I've transferred a level line right through the wall. I'll now gauge it up. Cut or carry? Cut. So this is my trusty six foot, which is already gauged up. So it's much easier than holding the tape. Just go to the sort of height you can reach. That there. And then what I'll do is I'll number it. So this will be um, on top, I'll go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then I'll go down 
in numbers as well. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen. Uh, and then I'll just do the same on the next profile. Cut it. So the reason that I've numbered the profiles is because this drops in the wall. It's much. Uh, it can be a very awkward, and you can forget quite easily where your um, line is to go. So I'm at eight, nine, ten here. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So this is the fifteenth course down from the level point. So, fifteenth course down is there. Oh, that'll be one more. Sorry, fifteen above that. Right, so I just want to check the line, make sure it's level, to make sure I am right. Which that is spot on there. Right, so I've got a level line there. Uh, what I'll have to do is run a course down to here, then build myself a little corner here, and then I'll be able to move that line back down and run in down to here. This here is my ground level. That's my ground level. I've got to be one course, uh, two course above that. I think we have one course above that, he said. Must be one, one course above ground level, which is there. So we're going to chuck a few bricks out, get some muck over, and uh, what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get all the engineering done first, and the reason being, uh, what I don't want to do is whack on one section of the wall right up. Because there's only a certain amount of access to this plot, um, once I've run my first section of all the engineering's in, I can then count up exactly what I need on the inside of the wall so we can get the bricks loaded out before we build the wall up. Um, which is going to cause you a pain in the ass if you get down the end and realise you can't get no bricks in. And then you've got to start walking around from the other side of the house when you can just have a good count up at the beginning. And it seems like it takes longer that way, but it works out better in the long run. Hello. Alright, All right, geezer. Yeah. Let me just get on here somewhere. These bricks are probably... I'd say the worst bricks to lay. <laughs> what about a fucking broken wrist as well? Uh, yeah, it ain't hurting. It ain't helping, it's hurting a bit. Well, it ain't broken, is it? It's just a uh, hairline fracture. <sighs> Got to be careful with these, because if you put too much muck down, you just end up pushing the ones out down below. I ain't got a lot of space. Sorry. Video's all over the shop. Excuse the bond below. See that squeezing that down because I tapped it down. When you tap them down, it will push the one down below. But when you, um, if you need to get these down, it, is, it needs to be sort of backwards and forwards. Uh, Wiggling it in. When you put press that press down just by hitting it straight down, they will just push the ones down below as well, which you don't want. Sometimes, don't I? Because they're running away. 
Have you just got a face? Yeah. Smooth sword. Ah. Rest over the weekend, eh? Rest? Yeah. We don't rest in this game. Forever fucking working. Does she fit? Does she fit? Of course she does. I've got your work, my girl. No, it don't fit. <laughs> so, considering we didn't come here to lay anything today, I mean, we got here, we didn't set profiles up to about 11, and uh, it's about half one, two now, so, um, oh, she ain't joined that, <laughs> just sort that out. Yeah, I think we've got down about 300 bricks, which ain't great, but, you know, it's all about Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Good to go. You don't yeah. fucking hang about, do ya? Huh? Oh, Straight that. in the motor. Yeah. Fuck the joint, and he can do it. Yeah. Fucking missed something, you bastard. Did I? Yeah. Right, baldy. You're like grey-haired old man. <laughs> well... Where's my keys at? Where's my keys, Louise? Fuck's Louise. <laughs> uh, right, so didn't all go as I thought I would go today. Um, obviously, I didn't set the profiles up. Uh, eight profiles. I set four up instead. But, out. but once we've got the um, engineering's done and I can see where the movement joints are going. I can set profiles up a lot easier. Um, I can set profiles up a lot easier then. Uh, Got to clean back. the thing out. Oh, yeah, well done. If someone's remembering shit. Yeah, so, but the, the reason, uh, it's good to um, do the engineers first. One, because you don't want to be building uh, the engineering's and then build straight on top of it because they will just swim about everywhere. Uh, it's good that we're only doing six courses with them engineering's because you ain't gonna get away with much more than 10 courses with them engineering's anyway. So uh, we're gonna, obviously, because we're just gonna do the engineers first, that way it gives it a chance to go off a bit and then uh, when the person's loading it out in front, they can see exactly what's, how many bricks is in the courses and how many courses we've got left. So they can actually work out exactly what bricks we need before we chuck it all up. Uh, so we don't overload it or underload it. Yeah. Aye, game. Go, see Go. Well, this is your fucking job. I can see that thumbprint on your forehead. <laughs>